does not listen, he's making Governor Emefele get away with hardship they inflicted on Nigerians, not on others. He claimed that the, inf the informal sector of the economy had been destroyed in recent weeks due to a lack of liquid cash. Hi guys, welcome back to Prospect Channel TV. Thank you for this coming out here. May God bless you. Oh, we are still in this uh, matter of uh, new Nera redesign saga and uh, the policy that is on ground right now. Nigerians have been passing through years because you will go to the bank. Most times they will tell you the, PO, the, the ATM is not working. And when it's working, you have to, you know, queue. Queue about 500 people. You will queue from morning till in the evening. And by the end of the day, 10,000 Naira will be given to you. If you are entering inside the bank, if you managed to, to, to be lucky, you find yourself inside the bank, they won't give you more than, you know, uh, 5,000 Naira. The CBN governor and federal government of Nigeria have insisted that this their policy stands. No old Naira. They said... The, the old Naira notes is no longer tender, uh, legal tender in Nigeria. So if you have it, it's now useless, you know, in your hands. Now, Nigerians are now saying that, good, this your policy is not bad, but can't you just make this new Naira available to Nigerians? But the CBN governor, Emifele, is giving reasons why things are happening like this. Yesterday, he said, that Nigerian government, the CBN government, is not going to go back from that their initial policy that the, the, the old Naira notes cease to exist on the 10th of February. So if you get them, bank not go to collect them from you. Or you the, the best thing you can do for yourself is take it to CBN. And taking it to CBN, you have to pass through you know, process before the CBN will receive it from you. Nigerians are saying that they should print more of these new Naira notes so that Naira, Nigerians will, will be able to see this Naira suspend. But MFL said something yesterday that politicians are buying the new Naira from the banks, making matter worse for the common man out there. Even the one when they bring out Say politicians, they go back, they go buy them from these people. Why are they buying the money? Now money, they say they do election. Anyway, make we see as this matter will be. The truth be say, this election when they come, hmm, Nigerians will never see this kind because it's not going to be business as usual. Something different is, is about to happen. It's going to be tough. And I swear, interesting. Let's quickly hit this news and get the full details. The Northern Elders Forum, NEF, has stated that President Muhammad Buhari is unwilling to summon the governor of the Central Bank of Nigeria, CBM, Godwin Emefele, despite the hardships that Nigerians are experiencing as a result of the Naira redesign policy. NEF spokesman Akim Baba Ahmed stated this on, on Tuesday on China's television's special election program, alleging that the CBN's Naira redesign policy and the resulting clash crunch demarketed the ruling All Progressive Congress APC in the general election. This money thing is a major demarketing thing for the APC. Baba Ahmed said, if the worst enemy of APC had designed strategy for them to lose this election, he couldn't have chosen a better uh, uh, Franco around the reprinting of the Naira. He claimed that the information, the informal sector of the economy had been destroyed in recent weeks due to the lack of liquid cash. The N. EF spokesman said 
there is a lot of anger to see a, a situation where the president rather appears unwilling or incapable of reign emifeles and say, listen, perhaps we can allow the old Naira and the new Naira coexist for the next six months. President Muhammad Buhari apparently does not listen to anybody. Emifele says, I will do what I should do because the president has caught my back. And Nigerians are saying, who we know the governor of the CBM is not who is doing all this. It is the president. If the president does not want all this suffering and considers the other options, the governor of the CBN won't get away with this thing he is getting away with. Following the whispered public outrage, the CBN extended the deadline for the exchanging old 200, 500, and 1,000 Naira notes from January 31st to February 10th, where the Federal Supreme Court ruled that the Nigerian government, the CBM, and the commercial banks could not continue with the deadline until the issue was resolved on February 15th. At least seven APC states have already sued the Nigerian government. However, the governor of the central bank insisted on Tuesday that the February 10th deadline for the validity of the old Naira remains in effect. Banks and gas stations and other commercial, commercial enterprises have already brought to subject old notes as of Friday 10th. Hmm. Buari listens very well. Don't you know that God is marvelous? All this, why he has been ruling with impunity and prejudice against Christians, he be, he be on our best brother and doing the work of jihad. Now his stubbornness have affected everyone, both Christian and Muslim, and you are now complaining. Okay, guys, someone just dropped that.